Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Alex, the Comic Order. Thank you so much for clicking play on this video. I feel like I have deja vu, but the best kind of deja vu because remember two months ago when everyone was chasing the high ratios in the Walmart packs? Well, I found a Walmart in a very small town and nobody had touched the variant packs. So these are the Walmart variant packs. These are the ones with the big ratios, one in 25s, one in 100s, one in 500s, one in 1000s. I think there's even like one in 2000s. It was insane. The chase was real. I'm pretty sure I already know I got two big chase books, but I'm excited to open these up. Hopefully you guys are ready for a little blast from two months ago past. Here we go. All right, guys, if I could have you pay attention for just a quick second. For the month of November, there's a code to save $15 off. It's Hoarder57, and you'll save $15 off. It's for U.S. only, and it expires November 30th, 2021. And it can't be combined with any other codes or promos, and it can't be applied to accepted make and offer orders. So you guys definitely check out Shortbox. The link is in the description below for Apple and iOS users. Use the code HORDER57 to save $15 off of your order. And I am excited about this offer. I'm really pumped to see what you guys get. So let me know if you plan on using this or let me know if you have used this in the comment section below. Thanks so much. All right, my friends, I've got nine packs and I'm super pumped about opening those up. These are the books that I got in the last go around. This is like a one in 200 or one in 500 Moon Knight number 200. Really nice. I think it's a Bill Sienkiewicz cover. Yeah, so that's pretty awesome. So I'll put that back here. And then I also got this. I think this is an Olivia, Olivier Coipel. Um, one in 500. Peter Parker Spider-Man or Spectacular Spider-Man number one. Spider-Man number one. I think it might be Spider-Man number one. Can't remember, but this is really, really nice. From my estimation, it looks like a contender. Um, could be very, very high-grade contender. That was one of my ones that I really, really enjoyed pulling out of those Walmart packs. Put that there. Then I got a couple of these uh, web heads, this uh, Patrick Gleason web heads, like one in 50, one in 25, something like that. Put those there. And those were the ones that I was pretty excited about in the last couple videos that I did two months ago. And I'm optimistic here, so I pulled out five my Mylar and some backing boards there. Here are the packs that I got this time. I got the two Aliens packs. I've got, let's see, two of these, Iron Man versus Quantum, Infinite Destinies. I've got three of the Star Wars High Republics. And then two of the Extreme Carnage. They did have some of the X-Men, of course. They had like two or three of those. They had two of the Black Cats. And I think they might have had some of the Captain Americas. But I, I just chose these ones as of right now. I didn't um, didn't quite look, you know, in the in the in trying to look in the spines to see if I recognized anything. I just went for it. I, I grabbed as many as I could of the ones that I wanted to. I know if they're there for two months, they'll be there for another week or two. So I can go back and get those. But I'm going to save the aliens for last. And I'm going to start with the Iron Man number one annual Infinite Destinies. I went back and watched some of these videos. There are some crazy, crazy videos. And I, and I went on eBay to look and see what was still out there or what, what was still selling from these. And believe it or not, uh, some of these high ratio books are still selling for, you know, 80 to 250 um, and maybe more for even some of the graded ones. Those were even for just raws. So I'm excited about uh, the opportunity to pull some of those big ratios. And I think from what I've seen, I think I may have two of them. So pretty pumped about that. I'll run through some of these pretty quickly, let you know if they're a variant or not. So this is the Iron Man. Here is Savage Vendors number 13. And then this is one that I have not seen. This is Iron Man number one, premier variant. 
and it's like the eighth variant for that one. So I'll set that one aside and we'll check that one out later. Could be nothing, but I always like to give a little, and I'll just put the uh, information down here. So if there's anything on that, you saw it. All right, next up is another one of these Iron Man versus Quantum annual number one. My knife isn't as sharp as I want it to be. Dang, the next book looks pretty cool. Iron Man, of course. This one looks really cool. This looks like an Alex Ross. So that one is a sweet Alex Ross. Um, it's the standard cover. Um, and this one is Captain America number six. Looks like, it really looks like an Alex Ross. Yeah, I'll confirm that. Um, really nice Stanley tribute here. Very, very classy looking book. Yep. And then this one, I have not seen this one, but I like it. And uh, seems to be something nonstop Spider-Man. Lucio Perillo variant. And this is a 616. So somebody put in my comments just this week. There, there's no there's no store exclusives in there. Guarantee it or something like that. And I said, I, I would beg to differ. Well, here you go. Here's a 616 store exclusive. I'll put down here if there's any, you know, uh, value to this one, which I'm sure there probably is. But it's a Lucio Perillo. Very, very nice. Could definitely use a pressing because it's got some spine ticks maybe one color breaking spine tick and just some dents um, so dang nice non-stop spider-man number one 616 jaws are collectibles so hey i like it nice nice perillo so that one will probably get the mylar treatment now we're on to star wars the high republic and of course, at the end of this video, I'll do like a little synopsis where I have the books in Mylar. We'll kind of go over, you know, after I've looked them up when I'm editing this. So, yeah, I think it'll be pretty fun. But there you go. There are store exclusives in these packs. Star Wars High Republic. You know what it is. And then, uh, really cool, Eternals number one, design variant, one in ten with Icarus and Sprite. The movie comes out this weekend. I'm pumped to see it. I don't care what people are saying about stupid reviews or Rotten Tomatoes. Like I go in there, I don't care what other people think about movies. If I like it, I like it. If I don't, I don't. I don't care if you liked it or not. It's not gonna change my opinion of the movie. So here we go. I'm excited. I don't care if it's getting you know, halfway rotten, halfway decent, um, or halfway rotten, halfway fresh. All right. Oh, we did get so okay. High Republic got my third Pat Gleason webhead. Our uh, Amazing Spider-Man 55. Nice. That'll probably get a little Mylar action. Here is a variant. This is Champions Outlaw. It's like 50 years of Man Thing, maybe. I don't know. Man Thing variant. Another one. So I'm hoping to get one of the big old big boys, one in 1,000, one in 500s maybe, hopefully one in, I think the one I've seen that I think I know is in here is a one in 500. So I'm hoping to get a couple one in 500s. But of course I want the one in 1,000s. I love chases, I love chases. All right, here we go, you all know. So happy, this is an identical pack to the first one, so Eternals. One in 10, Icarus and Sprite. All right, we are down to the last four. They fly by when you just zip them open. Um, this one's Extreme Carnage. Hopefully you guys enjoy this. Um, living vicariously through, I love living vicariously through the people who pull these or open these packs. And um, one of the reasons why I went for these initially was because I saw Ben C. Um, from CBSI put um, some information online and they showed the Tsum Tsum variant with uh, with uh, Miss Marvel. That's a huge cap. I don't think anyone's pulled any Tsum Tsum variants out of this. So we go Extreme Carnage. We've got a Strange Academy number six Arthur Adams variant. Pretty okay. And then we've got Champions number six, Reborn. 
with like the Doctor Doom Juggernaut guy here, and this is yeah the second second variant. So it's like a B cover. I'm not sure about that one. I've seen it in other people's videos, but I don't recall that it was anything like super extravagant or extraordinary. All right, another Extreme Carnage pack. So here's that. Looks to be almost identical. You've got this X416, and this is a standard cover. And then you've got Champions, once again, Heroes Reborn, number six, B cover or B variant. Now these next two are the Aliens packs. These are the ones that I believe have the higher ratio in them. And a lot of people have been pulling some pretty good, good things out of these ones. So we'll see if it's true. We will see if it's true. I'll be pretty pumped if it is. Um, it'll, it'll prove to myself that I can recognize one of the spines. So, yep, yeah, I already see it. Okay, Aliens, number four variant, Walmart exclusive. This one's kind of neat. It's a Mark Brooks. Fantastic Four, number 31. Nice Mark Brooks kind of neat looking. That's a standard cover. Yeah, 31. And here it is. One in 500 X-Men number one art germ virgin variant. One in 500. This baby was selling still in October. I think the most recent sale was like maybe 80 bucks. I'll, I'll confirm that. I'll double check that. But there are other sales for like 170 bucks, 250 bucks in October for this book. And this is in really really nice shape it needs a press just to get a few of these dings and wrinkles out and it's boom it's a contender so that's going to get the mylar treatment one more aliens pack to open so that did prove to me that i knew what i saw was what i saw and so i'm pretty excited that that was correct because this one that i had been looking for and one that i've been wanting to pull uh, I would love to pull one of the X-Men red number ones, like the one in 1,000 or one in 2,000 or whatever it was. First book up here is Aliens number one. Fantastic Four number 31. And boom, it was an identical pack. X-Men number one, Art Germ Virgin variant, one in 500. This one is just as good or better than the last copy. These are definitely 9-8 contenders so let me cut and just double check maybe that perillo book and we'll come back with some mylar goodness i guess i'm out of tape right now so i've got these books in mylar this is the non-stop spider-man number one lucio perillo variant it's a store exclusive from 616 uh this one's not going for very much there is a virgin variant cover as well and this one's probably about a ten dollar book but it's still a great lucio perillo I, I love that artist and i think he does a great job he uses a lot of charcoals too so really really great artist this one the amazing spider-man number 55 like the one in 50 one in 25 can't remember didn't even bother to look it up because i've got so many and i know there are so many out there i think it's still selling maybe 15 20 bucks but this is the big one this is the art germ one in 500 virgin variant let me look at these recent sales october 31st so just this weekend it sold for 89.99 so 90 dollars plus five dollars shipping and then before that on the 27th one for 177 dollars and 50 cents 20 bids so that was an auction that was a bid um, and then there was one on the 10th october 10th for 250 dollars and it was just a straight up um buy it now and then october 8th for 150 uh buy it now uh, plus seven dollars shipping and so these books are still selling there's one on ebay right now and it's an auction it's got some time left maybe a day or two left and it's already over 50 dollars. so really really cool thank you guys so much for watching if you're not already subscribed to the channel hit that subscription button hit that bell to be notified make sure to check out the link in the description below to download your short box app easiest way to buy and sell graded comic books online they're the sponsor of this channel and there is a hoarder 57 code at checkout you can save 15 dollars. so i believe that's free shipping then free shipping on, on on a book that you buy pretty much buy it now off of their um, app 
well worth it. You guys check it out. Definitely, uh, it's, it's a way to support this channel. Uh, use that code. This month it expires on the 30th. So download the app, peruse, see if there's anything you want to buy this month and use that code to buy a book of your choice, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button, comment down below, and I'll talk to you all in the next one. See ya, bye.